all right so hopefully this video doesn't lag anyone that doesn't know that's my boo that's my um, fiance that's charlie beans aka carly aka felipe for anyone that knows the felipe tracks <laughs> um but those are only for people that actually matter now second of all um somebody said it was nice to see me be humble bitch you wouldn't know what it's like to see me be humble um when i've actually made a fucking mistake i yeah i'll go out of my way to to do something right about it um but um you know honestly i gotta say though like to to, to the ignorant blind the people that just hate me just cause you hate my music you hate this just go away don't be so mad don't 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 worry about it it's okay you know you want me to rub you on your ass pat you on your ass tell you did a good job you hated me good, I cried. I went in the corner over there and I sucked my thumb. You want me you want me to tell you something like that? Huh? Get the fuck out of here. So now I got a forty ounce of old English. Alright, I'm gonna crack this bitch. Okay. Crack Bitch. I will say one thing. If somebody wants to say to me, well, Ninja, you did that song, My Block, because I got a lot of heat from My Block, whether or not you like the song or not, but I got a lot of heat. I heard more heat because it was like, you can't have a block because you're Canadian. Okay. A, you really need to learn about Canada, if that's what you think. If you think, you know, Canada's just fucking snowballs and, you know, um, with Murder Man or Fat Man Jersey, you made the comment. I, I giggled, but, you know, it's funny. It's funny in many ways, but a, drive, a Canadian drive-by is what, throwing a snowball? Um, last I checked, Canadian City was the murder capital of North America. Um, you know, and I, I don't mean to say that to, to talk like, oh shit, we're hard. Go to Toronto, you know, go to the T Dot, you know, go to fucking Hamilton, Ontario. Come even here, come to Sudbury, go to Vancouver, BC, go to Saskatchewan, go to Winnipeg, even go to my hometown, go to Victoria. You can get fucking shot up in more ways than you could possibly dream of, just like you can in every american major city just because we don't have huge inner city ghettos doesn't mean we don't have problems but um yeah vancouver toronto saskatchewan winnipeg and a lot of other parts like uh where carly has been brampton and other places for prime example uh these are cities that are majorly uh americanized um these are not candy ass cities that you can just walk around in and acting tough and now to say that I'm racist, why? Because I say the word nig uh Okay, I don't say E-R. And you know what? I've, I've said a lot in the past that, you know, you shouldn't drop that word. But you know what? Then again, in the same token, bitch, it's 2011. One of my best friends in the world is black. Do you think he gets mad when I say nigga? No, because he knows I ain't talking about him. If I called him a E-R, then he's going to get pissed off. And some people could say, well, there's no difference there is. Um, to me, there is because it's a fucking joke to begin with. Um, and, uh, you know, we're supposed to be in a society that's more accepting, yet everyone is just a bunch of tight-ass motherfuckers. Yeah, I got a lot of that pack, 12 and 0. But, uh, so, got this 40. Stop smiling at me, bitch. <laughs> uh, I got this 40, so I'll take a sip. Hopefully, you can hear the classic track. Um, I got it off YouTube. It's easy e sipping on a 40. Classic motherfucking track. But this is like as loud as it gets. It's maxed on my laptop and on here. So hopefully you hear it. Um, sipping on a 40. Uh, we're about to smoke a blunt. You know, sipping on a 40. Smoke some endo. So we do that. And we'll come back, talk a bit. And I'll tell you how to go fuck yourself. And how I had sex with your mother last night. And all that good old happy what? shit. I fucked your mom last night. No way you can have it. Uh, I've seen her mom. I don't want her. <laughs> mm -mm. Okay, back to the track. I can have her. Fuck, that's scary. <laughs> you want some? You want it? Marijuana is bad, okay? I'm gonna post it on yours and post it on mine. Hi, haters.
I could break out for the fireball and the vodka for y'all. But I thought a 40 OE was more appropriate. And I blame her. I ain't had 40s of Old English since I was 14 years old, 16 years ago. By her? Yeah. Well, let's get 40s of OE. No, I average a couple of days, don't I? I got a good return on 40 ounces. Only if you could get a return on fucking weed. All your roaches were like empties. You trade them in and you get more. <laughs> that would be bomb. Okay, with all due respect to Easy e that track's just too low on the volume. Um, and yeah, uh, hopefully you could hear it while I'm on. Um, but uh, to, um, I'm gonna play a track that I really, in, uh, which wouldn't do I wanna play actually. Uh. Okay, one sec. Just trying to find a track I really wanna play. One sec, y'all. Sorry, one sec. Are you yeah, I know, but there's a trap I'm trying to... Are you serious? Are you serious? Okay, one second here. If the shit will fucking start up, then maybe. I still really do think. Holy shit. Here we go. Six Ninjas off the yellow mixtape. www.sixninjas.com. What? Obviously, I gotta give a few shout outs. I'd give shout outs to my boo, but she's like right here with me. So, props. Yeah, some dupes. All right. <laughs> Got some love. All right, all right. Uh, Carly Blunt, uh, nothing but love, AKA Big Tits, as Carly here calls you. <laughs> Carly Blunt is C A R L E E. This Carly is K A R. So, you know, as this Carly would be my fiance. Carly Blunt would say she's my American wifey and Carly here calls her big tits. And yes, you are big tits. Um, to Michelle Salazar, well, you're just a shit. So keep being you, keep being psychotic and keep hitting up Carly on the cell phone and asking her to fucking punch me and shit like that, eh? It's not cool. <laughs> not cool. Um, yes, it is. <laughs> fuck, who else? And my brother Ganja back home. 
back home, back home. Even though I'm Canadian, I say back home. I think of Wisconsin and all I can think of is home. I fucking loved living in Wisconsin. Wisconsin's the shit. It is. Um, but no, fucking uh, Goofy Noofy Meg, Megan Sullivan. <laughs> yeah, goofy Noofy, eh? Yes, I'm back in Canada. No doubt about it, eh? Um, Devil Tree, shut up if you see this video. I know you'll see it even if you don't comment. Sorry, Scott didn't have uh, Stephen French. Uh, J <laughs> JC, what's up with you? You just hit me up on the phone. Shit, I don't know. There's a lot of fucking people. Fucking fat teddy kitty, if you see this shit and you ever speak to me again, what's up? What's good? Everything was all fat in the gravy. Kitty. Yeah, fat teddy kitty. AKA okay, the sandwich lady. She used to come by radio shows and blog TV shows and she'd be like, yo, who wants what sandwich today? She was a sandwich lady. Yeah, so. You'd have to be there to know it, right? Me and so. like half of um, uh, Beauty Shop. Yeah, maybe, I guess. I don't know. But the whole point is, this, and there's a f fuck, there's so many people. I say shout outs and it's like, whatever. You know, and anyone that wants to diss me and say, you know, hey, you know, fuck anyone that's down with True Productions. A, it's T dot R dot U Productions to begin with. Um, and there's a lot more people than just me. Not that y'all have seen that yet. Not that y'all really care. Uh, for those that do, they already know that. But <clears throat> it's fun. It's expression. It's self-expression first and foremost. But everything we're doing is about having fun. And I don't care if people like me or not I'm not gonna sit here and push myself to extreme levels just cuz y'all say that's what I need to do um, and just like most people tell me I tend to believe it anyways because a I know this when something sucks so bad you just do you you will pay it no attention it's so bad you don't even want to watch it just like child's play ninja sorry I had to say it that's why I can't watch your videos if you're watching me or as anyone is, you know, the people that can't stand me. Why I can't watch that video is because I don't like that person. And this isn't me attacking, okay? This is me telling you. I don't enjoy this person. And we have friends in common. We have people that have said to me, you know, I hate this. And you know what? Even though I was a dick, even though I was righteous in my statements in my eyes, I was a dick. I'll admit that. But I said, you know what? I don't want to be the friend that always is like, yo, I'm putting people right in the middle. Or I don't want to be the guy that's constantly acting too juvenile to fucking pull my little fucking vagina out of my diaper. You know what I'm saying? You know, just pull that little twat out and it's okay. You know, pat you on the bum, tell you it's alright, tell you you did a good job, you know. It's okay, you made a video on YouTube and people like, yay, you know. Walk down the street, nobody cares that you exist, but people on YouTube like you. You know you done good, right? Yeah, you done no. You done no, brethren. <laughs> you don't even know. Okay, what, well, what? Well, Carly, you say it then. Brethren. Brethren. You fucking say Fuck you. Half of what we know comes from fucking black people. Yeah, fucking dead no. You done no, star? Everything is just pieces of your own fucking kids And this is the world where we fucking live But at the end of the day I say this Oh, what's that fucking thing? What's that sound? Everybody look what's going down Stop, hey, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down Stop, now, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down Stop, ninja, what's that sound? Like for you, girl, one cash and it'd be your only reason to stay alive. Stay alive. Now we're standing on the top of this building. Looking down through the stands up and thinking of people. But I ain't made a video in a while, so if you like me, cool. Stay with me if you don't. Bye bye. But hey, what would you expect, right? Probably gonna do another 10 minutes or so. I might even try just to do a half an hour long video just because I never have done a half an hour video in one segment. Just to remind y'all that even though you hate me, you love me. Even though you love me, you hate me. You only look at my penis because it's bigger than yours. You only talk shit because...
I love my penis is bigger than yours, okay? If your girlfriend's penis is bigger than yours, run and know that you're you're fucked. Okay? You're fucked. Your chick has a clitinus. A clitinus? No. It what why would I call it a clit enus? A clit enus. A clit penis. What is that? Get was, your stick stop saying. But that, that was called something else. China had that. China had um. No. What was it called? No. Fuck, that's gonna piss me off. We'll be back in a second. I'm gonna figure it out. I get out of this shit, but I need some help. And I'm calling out loud. I need my name to say I need it right now. You can no. give me a hand so that I can feel proud. Everyone should do the part of this. No pissing. That's a five dollar fee. Wait, that's done. But yeah, that's the six ninjas. You know what? For my homeboys, I'm actually gonna play one more track here. Um, you know, to anyone, you know, just kind of kick it, chill, and talk and whatnot. If you can make it through this video, cool. If you can't, I understand it. And if you hate me, well, then welcome for coming, I guess. So I heard some of yeah. you want to become firefighters, uh -huh. UFC fighters, doctors, yeah. oh, yeah. fucking electricians. What's up, bitch? Whatever the fuck that is, I just want to become a fucking joker. Okay. Those of you that think the song is about you. But really? I'm a racist? Really? Really? I've lived in the most culturally diverse cities that you can possibly be. If you've lived in BC, you've lived in Alberta, you've been to the few places that I've been, and I'm not just saying that these places are hardcore, they're not just, you know what I'm saying? These are the most culturally diverse as far as, go to British Columbia, Canada, okay? Go to Vancouver, and go to the different parts. You wanna see a culturally diverse city? A, it is the number one desired place to move to in the world. It has the, the highest murder rate in North America, and it is a a beautiful place b it's a great you know it's a great place to live c it's extremely expensive d it's fucked up e it is like i said the most culturally diverse and you've got everybody you go to richmond it is completely chinese completely like i mean i'm serious the only reason you know it's a toronto dominion bank if you know what the td bank is is because you know the symbol because it's all in chinese you know what i'm saying um you know, and that's just, you know, you go to Surrey, it's all East Indian, you go to here, it's, you know what I mean? I come from very culturally diverse cities. That's where I was born and raised, you know? People that talk shit on me and say, you're Canadian, you can't do this, you can't do that. Um, you know, you don't know this, you don't know that. I don't sit here and say that I'm anything better because I'm Canadian. Because, you know, there is the big, big fight between... Americans to Canadians. Um, any intelligent American, just like any intelligent Canadian, uh, will sit there and they'll know the difference. And you know, you just you're smart enough to know what's bullshit and what's not. Typically, in the past, you know, America's been the country to go in. They start the war. You know, like it or not, you start the war. I know your troops don't. I know what the troops do are good, but the country starts the war because they feel that they got to put their opinion in there and Canada goes in and neutralizes you know we're the peacekeepers we don't necessarily want that war but we're make we're there to um, make sure everything's copacetic if you understand so I guess we're pussies right okay 9-11 happens fucking tragedy it's a bit of an inside job a bit in, in many ways this we're not gonna get into that shit anyways Canadians go over to Afghanistan for the first time start fighting and nine out of the eleven Al Jahira or fucking whatever the technical term for that shit is, because you know what? Other than those people are bad people, I don't really care much past that. Nine of the eleven people on the list were picked off by Canadian snipers. You know, and that was that was a that was a pride for, for, for Canada, right? Why? Because we have better training. 
you know we don't have the mass money we don't have the mass people but we have superior training we have superior brain thought okay now and this is not me dissing anything it's not me Carly shut up you're really fucking me up right now it's not me saying Canadians are better than Americans okay no kindness has been mistaken for a weakness in this case people think well there's 30 million Canadians 400 million Americans what could Canadians know about struggle um come down to our streets I can show you Vancouver is a city as large as the size of a city as Chicago if not larger as is Toronto you know what I'm saying I've been to well I haven't been to Toronto pardon me I know many people who have and I know Toronto's fucked up but been to Vancouver, been to Chicago, been to Milwaukee, been to St. Louis. I've been to different places, and I'm just telling you, while mentality is different everywhere you go, trust me, each and one of those cities, you can get murdered for the very same reason in so many different ways. So to sit there and slander on someone and slander on something they do because of what country they're from or to hate on Canadians and say we're pussies because of, that's an ignorant, uneducated statement you know and me with the the snipers and everything I'm not proud of that I mean your average Canadian like me is not proud of the fact that our troops went back to war we liked being peacekeepers why because everywhere you go in the world there's gonna be a ton of fucked up shit there's gonna be all these types of problems you know but really who who the fuck is myself you know or or yourself even to sit there and dictate to another human being what is normal, what is regular, and what is okay in their society. You know, over overseas, you know, the Far East, they've been fighting the Holy War for years now. Um, and unfortunately, North America's tossed up in it because of the oil and shit. But fuck between Texas and Alberta and, you know, even Fort St. John in B.C., there's enough oil to fucking cover North America, like like that and done but you know because we got the foreign trade we got all this bullshit you know wait wait I better shut up okay I'm starting to talk on some educated shit I'm a retarded idiot that doesn't know anything I'm gonna put some tunes back on so I can look stupid again I'm a man, so I'ma make your life hyphy Goofy motherfucker to make your life might seem better So one day I thought I'd be bright Get a buddy to say Rip cast this into for life Yeah, alright That's funny, right? We're going to be the motherfucker rock all night Answering phone calls You're always messing up I'm always cleaning it up Once again, what the fuck? Just fuck up with your son Chill out, man I never give it a class to rule that out You knew that now But you pursued the clowns So give it a rest Cause you know I was pretending, never meant it, I'm a That's troublemaker. Insane. Like I'll I said, I'm a drunk ass dude, but rock star straight. And I'm no oh. better than I. Please believe me, I only fuck drunk chicks in the free team. It's what I do. I Your mama so fat she takes shits at the dump. You dumb motherfucker. I got lots of new skin. It's cause I'm a joker. My punchlines are hurtful, but I'm certain that I'm fucking your bitch. I'm that dumb bitch. You're the word then. Fucking gas, fucking dicks are so old that they evolved into trash holes. And your boss fucking asshole farts dust. Come on, you wanna fuck in us? We all assholes. Mad problematic. Send us nigga pics when me and Cash laugh at ya And get on Brad is an alcoholic Hey, you stole my cigarette, you bitch ass Oh shit, that was a little bad Oh, I keep sitting on my feet and my feet go to sleep, man My feet go to sleep But you fat motherfucker can't even see your thighs So when you look down, you eventually cry I'm just fucking with ya It's what I do But uh, basically, you know, to anyone that actually gives a shit or not, maybe once or twice a week, I'll be by. Why? Because I can. Why? Because I did. Why? Because I like to talk as much shit as possible. Um, and it is the internet, so, I mean, it's as real as, well, the internet. It's online. Anyone can be tough online, right? Anyone can be cool online. What? It's true. Yeah, see? 
Stop. We, <laughs> I'm gonna kick. I'm not gonna allow her in any more of my videos. I mean, fuck. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> but anyways, this. You know, anyone that knows me, I come kick it. I don't. I can't do the radio shows no more. I mean, um, you know, if it was worth it, I'd probably do it. But everything done changed. You know, everyone went from actually, even though it was like a bunch of individuals together, it went from being a bunch of individuals that would rationalize to a bunch of individuals that was trying to make profit sharing and be cool up on YouTube. We're all a bunch of people that are fans of ICP. We don't have to like each other just because we are jugglos. Although I'm not saying hate one another, um, <clears throat> but we're people. We're people that like music. First and foremost, we're not just going to get along just because. And anyone that's going to sit there and take a side just because and sit there and say, well, you're this and that, but you're supposed to be a juggalo, but this and that. Motherfucker, I'm a goddamn human being. Things piss me off just like they piss off every other motherfucking human being. The only difference is I'm bipolar. The only difference is I got a few personalities. The only difference is, frankly, my dear, I don't give a fuck. And the only difference is, is I'm old enough that I'll tell you to go fuck yourself in each and every way. Each and every single day. Why? Because I can. Why? Because I did. Because that's my promise from me to you, bitch ass. So, yeah. Back to the music. What? Don't wiggle your toes. Oh, really? That's your problem. You never knew we were only joking. Constantly, by the way, bitch, I don't drive that. I whip the Honda Civic, then I'm made back. Remember that? I said I was a nine inch. Fuck that, I'm just the average guy that's within you. Hi, I'm Thomas Price, a whole new guy that's created with my mind. I rant with an accent, I like fucking fat chicks. Fucking condom, cause I'm only using plastic. The six didn't give her the dick, homie, but we might have been lonely. She wasn't so ugly. It's not that fast, she just needed to back God damn, wanna get over it Wanna hit me? Okay, so On that note, to play this video out I'm gonna finish that track in a second here The whole point is, is you know what As much as anyone wants to talk shit As much as anyone wants to say You're this, you're that You know what, you don't actually know You don't know me um, you don't know what I do in my daily life, so all you can do is actually run your mouth like a little bitch, um, because you don't actually know anything. You can sit there and you can say a lot of stuff. The one thing y'all don't know about me, and I'm going to clue this in to you right now, to anyone that doesn't know, doesn't, you know, and some will say bull. The one thing about me is I'm a cold-hearted son of a bitch. And you can even ask her. She loves me, but she knows that. Um, I will say the most low down dirty things like when you cross that line with me I will play games with you that will make your grandparents 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 roll in their grave why because well I'm an evil motherfucker I love to be nice but when you fuck with my head um oh well I'll just say and do things why because I can why because it doesn't mean shit to me why because it's not real you know what I'm saying? Um, so y'all can say about me what you want. Y'all can do whatever you want. You can make whatever statements you want. But at the end of the day, all it is is you're going to slap him because it's not once ever stopped me from doing what I've done. And it never will. Can 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 never will stop me from doing what I do. <laughs> there we go. There's the words. I blame it on being drunk, but I just get confused sometimes. She says it's because I'm getting older. Old man. But hey, what would I know? I'm just a dumbass, right? I'm just fucking with you. So this has been an episode of whatever. Had a smoke, had a drink, had a talk, had some tunes. 
I fucked your mother, I fucked your sister, I fucked your dog, I fucked that polar bear in your backyard. Don't poke me with your feet. I'm just fucking with you. It's what I do, what I do. I'm just fucking with you Cause I'm a joker It's what I do It's now that we at the end of the song I just wanted to say I'm the reason you're on Brown's Gone, Brown Dempsey Fucking asshole Come back production. What up? So I So, that be it, that be all you, 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 you heard? Big Bird is the motherfucking word. Felipe ripped the polar bear. <laughs> Enough said. Deuces. Bye. Okay, yeah. And um, if you see a pink flamingo rocking a dildo, I suggest you run. Alright, words from the wise. Keep it true. Deuces, bitch. <laughs>